welcome to my channel my name is Aki this is the first time and for those who's been watching thank you so much for coming back today sorry it's really a hot mess I feel like I don't know we don't go out so I don't feel like I want to change my clothes or like put on makeup so I'm still in my pajama and I have not brushed my hair <laughs> and no makeup <laughs> so I need to have a little distance to cover up my skin <laughs> anyway um, and there's gonna be some noise coming from my son's room I'm sorry if it's if it bothers you but today I want to do something spring spring-ish I mean even though Toronto Feel like still winter but <laughs> in my house there are few plants that are flowering so I thought I would show you my blooming plants as you can see my first one would be right here my peace lily it's a variegated peace lily and I think you see my um, low light plants video that they were starting to bloom and so there is one flower and then you can see there's actually another one trying to, I don't know if you can see it, but there's actually another one blooming, like is, is the flowers there are just trying to reach a little higher like this guy. So these are blooming now. It bloomed last year and then it bloomed for me this year too. They do okay in a like medium to low light, but if you want them to bloom, they need higher light. So I think this is like like five meter away from the south west facing big window. We live in a condo, so we have a big window here. So it does get a really good light. So that's why they are blooming. So if you want your peace lily to bloom, you should put it um, in a at least medium to higher light. And my second one would be um, this is almost done. But it's a pink polka dot plant and it doesn't even look like a polka dot plant with all those. It's losing all this pink. I don't know why, but this is pretty much done. But you can see there is a purple flower right here. I don't know if it's zooming or focusing, but they do bloom. This pretty purple flower. And, but they are, as they grow taller they are they're losing all the oh i don't know if that was a spider web or a spider mite web but it looked i think it was a regular spider web but yeah they i wish it would stay pink but it's losing all the colors but they did bloom for me so i guess it's okay I do like the plant that blooms. They're really cute and you know, it light up the space, right? So this is another one. It's a polka dot plant. They do bloom. And the second one, I mean the third one would be this. This is almost done as well, but this is the Caesarea, let's go the Snow Rose. They're really good for bonsai. If you want to do a bonsai, you, this tree or this plant would be a perfect plant um, to have bonsai. And this one has a very beautiful pink flower as well. I don't know if it's focusing, but I would do a little video later with all the flowers. And the leaves are very beautiful as well. It has a white outlining outside. And yeah, you can trim it and try to do your bonsai. And I do want to look for a little shallow um, pot so that it will look more like bonsai tree. But for now, he's okay in here and it did bloom. Like it was like, it was like flower everywhere. It almost reminded me of a sakura tree, like cherry blossom, like um, cherry blossom flowers. So this kind of reminded me of Japan around this time of the year. So this is 
my third one and then the next two do not look like flowers but they are blooming and one is my peperomia rosso and yeah they do not have petal like flower petal or anything but all this okay stupid phone call uh interrupted my I know, but I don't know that numbers. I don't. I do not pick up any number that I don't know because there's a lot of spams. Oh, but mommy, they keep calling me. me. Anyway, so this mommy, is a um, peperomia rosso, and all this me. thing that's they're sticking coming. out, these are flowers. They don't have petals, but they're flowers, and apparently you can also like pollinate them mommy, if you. Mommy. Um, search how to pollinate. My uh, one of my friends recommended me, but I don't think I would. <laughs> I know I don't have enough energy to do that, but this is very beautiful. It has a red stem and um, it's just funky too, right? It looks very funky. They all reach for the light, and um, yeah, it looks like a snake coming out of the bush, <laughs> like Medusa. <laughs> But this is very cool looking flower. And then the next one is also a peperomia, so they will look similar. And this is the peperomia angurata. Um, so they look similar to my peperomia rosso. They're like straight, long, I guess they're called flower. <laughs> but they reach for the light. I have it under the LED light, so. They all grow like they're like <laughs> stretching out so long. I wonder if this is normal. Like it's so long. Um, I used to. Have, oop, I guess I think it's been flowering for a long time. So maybe it's the end of the end of the flowering season because they just one just fell off. So yeah, they they look really funky looking, and I really love this one so much as well. But yeah, these are flowers, isn't it? It's so funky looking. But so this is uh, my first one. And the last one that I have it flowering right now, it's getting hot in the house, is this beautiful Easter cactus. Isn't this pretty? It's just so gorgeous and so pretty. So I picked it up on my last plant shopping. I guess it was like, I have a video too. It was like a pickup. So I have to, um, it was like drive up and pick up, take out. So I went to pick it up and it was all, it had all buds and then it started to bloom like a few days after. It's almost full bloom, but they, open in the morning and then at like towards closer to the evening they they close again and then open back up in the morning again so these are like perfect for Easter the colors just beautiful aren't they so I do have a Christmas cactus as well that when I picked it up last year it dropped maybe it's flower one and then like drop rest of the buds and then somehow decided to bloom again like few like it was like maybe last week or two weeks ago so they started to bloom around the same time these guys bloom so that was weird but apparently that's normal i seen other like um instagram um plant friends um christmas cactus blooming as well so as long as they get a good life i think they they bloom very well so yeah, so these are my blooming plants for now. I do have other plants that also bloom in the past, but they're not blooming right now. But I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you like this video, please give a thumbs up and also subscribe if you haven't hit that button right now. So I see you in my next one. Bye.